Welcome to the Happy Caravan. I'm a dad of 11 kids and we're off to Costco and Trader Joe's. So come along with us and we'll show you what we buy to feed our family of 13 for a week. We are off to Costco. We've got Moses here with us today. Hi Mo, how are you doing? And then we've got Chloe and Melody and Anna. Anna's dressing cold right now so we gotta get in the store. All right. tomatoes. This is a good deal. For $8.99 you're getting eight cans. That's pretty awesome. And they're good too. What do you think Mo? Got yeah. list? Ready? Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. Uh, you can, you can get two. Okay, go get another one. So we're getting some ancient grains probiotic granola. It's not great for you but at least it has some good things in it. And Get some Parmesan cheese. Josiah loves this. It's like it's going out of style. <laughs> now, can we put it in here? No. You want to hold it with you? Okay. Right, you want to show us what's under that jacket? <gasps> You're Spider-Man. Wow. I thought there was something interesting about you. Okay. We're gonna get some Kirkland organic spread. Thank you, Chloe. And this, wow, this is really going up in price. This used to be $21. But you know what? It's very expensive to find these. So, anyway, we'll, we'll take it. Nice pine nuts, organic. And I'm not sure where they come from. That used to come from Russia. Oh, product of China now. A hard thing to get out of pine cones. You don't like these? No, We're gonna get some Ghirardelli chocolates. Mo likes those? Yeah. Are they yummy? Okay. Get a Costco chicken also. Oh, it's cheap and good. Hey, Amber, so there's, uh, there is no prime rib. There are only beef rib roast bone in, um, or uh, beef ribeye roast. What do you think? Um, probably the, the beef ribeye roast, probably, or the, the, the rib, the, the bone in rib roast? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, all right, well, well, that's what we'll get. Okay, that's okay. It's one seat. Thank you. Love you. Bye. Bye. Love you. So for New Year's, we're going to have a beef rib roast bone-in, which looks absolutely delicious. That yeah, should be yeah, fun. Yeah, we'll have yeah. to learn how to cook this. Kirkland organic yogurt, Greek yogurt, and then I use Mark Nelly's. Kids love those. Okay, we're going to get three Kirkland cheddar cheeses. This again is a really great deal. It's uh, two pounds each. And stick these in the cart here. We're going to get some juicy apples. These actually live up to their name. They're pretty good. We're going to get some bananas also. This is generally a challenge in the evening because they've all been picked through. Let's see here. We're going to get to the ones that haven't been touched. They're usually okay. for these. 
pieces. These grapefruits look pretty good, so we're gonna, gonna go for that. Kids love having these. Uh, that's a good day. Let's see. Those are good. You like grapefruits, Moses? Yeah. And then we also need some lemons. Got to be careful. One bad lemon makes the whole bunch go bad. So, those aren't looking so hot. Let's see. When we had a lemon tree in San Diego, we would always pick the ones that were really the deepest yellow because those were the most ripe. But unfortunately, in, in a bag like that, one of those could be rotten and that's the end of it. Are those apples, Moses? Do you say apple? Yum. Simmons, Mo. Look at that. Oh, oh strawberries too. Let's get some strawberries. Okay? No. Okay. No strawberries. No strawberries? Yeah. Look, Mo. Don't they look good? No. Look over here. Yeah. Yum. Yeah. Yeah, they, they look pretty good. They're better than the ones that we saw last week. No. Oh, those are good. Here, can you put those in the cart for me? No. No? <laughs> here, let's put them right there. We're going to get two packs of those, okay? Yeah. Let's get two packs. Right, so we're doing good. Okay. Come on, Moses. Help me put them down. You don't like strawberries? So we've got some candy snap red seedless grapes. Yeah. And some white... Seedless table grapes. Those are pretty good. Then we're gonna get uh, get some onions. We need that for cooking. And some cucumbers. The cucumbers. You're always looking for if the end where the stem is is soft that's a bad cucumber so let's see okay you finally found one goes in there we're gonna get some russet potatoes Huge. Sometimes we just have these gantrum potatoes in there. I think that's good. Okay. And get a Caesar salad also for the kids. Eat that. A little tisserie chicken. Good. Okay. 
Look, Mo, asparagus. No. Yeah. Got some Hawaiian rolls for Christmas or uh, for New Year's Eve. Get some Hawaiian rolls for New Year's dinner. Two pomegranate juices. by the kids. <laughs> organic grass fed is pretty good actually. Make some sour cream. Two types of kombucha here. You're gonna get uh, the Costco ginger lemon. It's really good. Liquid CoQ10, um, liquid turmeric, which has been really good, and some best toothpaste. Um, I like this stuff because it does not have, um, I think it's like triclosan or something like that, but yeah, this stuff does not have it, so we tend to purchase that. And then also we're getting some collagen peptides collagen powder. And then during the holidays we always run out of our Ziplocs, so we're going to get the gallon size freezer Ziplocs, also some quart size Ziplocs, and sandwich bags. Pretty high today. Water bottles. So we have two bags of organic spring mix. Five, but that's going to have to work for today. Put it down. Oh. And I'm so heavy. 
heavy cream, but I don't see any. I'm leaving it out. Oh no, only half and half. Well, we do need some half and half. So we we'll get that. And we'll get some golden potatoes also. What's that? Yes, and those are sweet peppers. They're like mini, mini, they're like mini bell peppers. No, they're mini bell peppers. And we'll get one Tuscan penne. And we want one of these sourdoughs here. Let's see. Oh, okay, and here. We're going to get uh, two of these basically baguettes, but they're really uh, Italian bread, but we'll put these in the oven and bake them up. We've got our corn tortillas and whole wheat tortillas, white tortillas. And I think we need one more, one more pack of corn tortillas on this list has it on there twice. One for two packs and one for three. So we'll get one more pack. Uh-oh. I think we grabbed the last ones. Oh, okay. Can I drink some water in there? Yes, go ahead. them later. Need some pepperonis and get some white rice.
Oh, okay. We do have the peppers. That's good. Glad that we were able to make it through. Now I've got to rush over to Lincoln Market. Total was 257 tonight. So Mark is home from Trader Joe's. We want to see what he got. Yeah. Um, so he got these potatoes. This is what we're having. Um, the yeah, with the corn chowder. And corn chowder, we have these potatoes. We're having some flour to the greens mix. This is good for smoothies. Josiah just eats it straight. This is for our New Year's Day salad. We have kind of a green leafy salad. And this is also for our salad New Year's Day. We're having some walnut pieces in there. A couple of corn tortillas. Two of these are for uh, chili, like a chicken ole, kind of a, a Mexican style chicken casserole. Here's our burrito tortillas that we have. And here's some mozzarella cheese. We're having pizza bread. On New Year's Day, we're gonna have a little fancy breakfast. So we're having some breakfast sausage and chives. That's for our potatoes that we're having on New Year's Day too. Having some half and half. This is for the corn chowder we're going to make. This is for our charcuterie board. We have this on Thursday for lunch. Naomi uh, usually makes that for us. Have some salami and also some prosciutto on the chicken board as well. This is for our sandwiches. This is for the pizza we're gonna have. <laughs> Lots of lunch, lunch items. This is a sweet onion with the lentils and rice. We have a little satini concombre, which is like a cucumber salad, and that's a sweet onion for that. We have some sourdough bread for our sandwiches, and we also have some Tuscan pane. That's what we're going to make our pizza bread with. We have some bacon. One of the bacons is for our lentils and rice, and one of the bacons is for our corn chowder. Got some white jasmine rice. We have that with our Tuesday chicken, which is kind of a faux fried chicken, um, but we have it on Friday. <laughs> also, I have some sliced cheeses for our sandwiches on Saturday. Some Ezekiel bread. I usually um, eat this for snacks. Melody also really likes it too. Uh, we got this chocolate. This chocolate is super yummy. It's from Trader Joe's and we just have it for like a little treat after a meal. And then we have these little green chili cans and these are for our chicken ole. It's um, our chicken casserole that we're making. And here's some pizza sauce. This is gonna be with our pizza bread. So let's take it over here. <laughs> just easy lunch. Um, the kids love this pico de gallo salsa as well as this guaca salsa it just makes our burritos, which can be a bit boring, much more exciting. Here's our corn for the corn chowder. Yes, it takes three bags. <laughs> That's why it's so sweet and yummy. Then we've got this almond milk. This is what I drink in my smoothies in the morning. Uh, if we're out of milk, sometimes the kids will drink it too. Here's our buttermilk. This is for our salad dressing that we make with our Tuesday chicken, homemade ranch. The kids love it. Here are the Aussie style chocolate cream sandwich cookies. These are amazing, <laughs> dangerously amazing. And then we have these multi-flavor 
Trader Joe Joe's and they are just like basically like a Oreo style, different kinds of Oreos enrobed in chocolate and they are so good. Also these Maple Leaf cookies. I think they may actually have real maple syrup in them. I'm not sure. Yeah, wow, it does. So those are a real treat. And while we're on the cookie theme, we also have some dark chocolate chunk almond cookies. Thankfully, with even though this is, seems like a lot of cookies with our family, we just go through a lot of them very quickly. Please, we have this with our Tuesday chicken and rice. And then we have this baguette bread. This is Fisel. It's kind of a half-baked uh, bread from Trader Joe's. And when you bake it, it tastes really fresh like you just made it at home. Okay, and for our final store, we went, uh, Mark went to Lincoln Market. And he got us some Lincoln Market stuff. These soups are so good. This Amy's organic soup is fantastic. So if you're ever looking for a good soup, we're actually going to use this in our chicken casserole that we're making yes also we have the specific brand cream of chicken soup um this is also pretty good as far as the ingredient profile goes it's a lot less added stuff than the campbell stuff this is the um also for our casserole then we're having some heavy cream this is something yomi asked for for our new year's breakfast i'm assuming she's probably gonna make whipped cream on our waffles which will be very yummy also, we have some of this Hellman's mayonnaise. This is good for our salad dressing. It's just a really neutral taste. I prefer avocado mayonnaise for most things, but for dressing, this is um, really good. Got some thyme. This is what we're gonna put in our lentils and rice. That's one of our favorite staple meals. Oh. Cheap, good, quality food. <laughs> you had some water, was that good? Yes. Then this is what I got for our New Year's Eve party. Yeah. I was gonna make another fruit salad plate yeah. and the kids really enjoyed the yogurt with the walnuts and the coconut on there for a uh, like a fruit salad treat. So that was something my mom did when I was a kid and I passed on the tradition and <laughs> they like it. Also some ginger. This is good for our lentils and rice dish that we're making. I've made it before on our What We Eat in a Week videos, but I'll show you coming up this next week how we make it. Also this basil, this is for our pesto. Our kids uh, actually will eat greens in the form of pesto, so I'm going to, <laughs> I'm gonna make it for them. Also some lentils, this is for our lentils and rice. And some jack cheese, this is for our chicken, chicken ole casserole, so there we go. And even though I didn't go with them, we're gonna have a date night kiss. <laughs> Try a little easier. <laughs> yes. I love you. That is ginger. Oh. Yes, that's ginger. As you can see, we got a pizza from Costco. We have some recycling to do. That's lemon yogurt. We're gonna have it on our fruit salad. Are you excited? Oh. Does that look so good? Is that yummy? Did you yeah. like the fruit salad? Yeah. And that's another one. That's another yogurt. That's two yogurts. One, two. Like you, you're too. <laughs> uh.